Hi, kitty cats. I was asked how much pain I felt during the entire process of gender affirming surgery, and since I had both top and bottom surgery, I thought it was worth talking about in a separate video. Now, throughout the past two weeks of recovery, I have never felt more than about a two out of 10 in terms of pain. Now, admittedly, my relationship with pain has never been exactly normal, and my results are certainly only mine. In the hospital, I don't know exactly what painkillers I received. When I looked at the IV, I only saw modified ringer solution, electrolytes, and supplementary antibiotics. There were likely painkillers I didn't recognize during that time. At the very least, I'm not that kind of doctor. In the past week, however, I've used nothing more extensive than Tylenol for pain relief and that kind of sparingly. Now, obviously, the procedures I got were less invasive than they could have been. My bottom surgery was minimal depth, and my top surgery was subfacial, so above the muscle. But I also credit complete bed rest for the week after surgery for how easily I appear to have recovered. I started to get sharp needle-like pain at the bottom surgery site, and I understand this is the sensation nerves make as they reconnect. So while I can't say that all the new parts have come back online, it appears they are at least booting, and I think after some device driver checks and updates, I expect them to become fully armed and operational. Probably still gonna have to log in and check my files are intact, but things are looking promising. This is a hugely exciting time for me in so many ways. I feel exceptionally fortunate, and I'm glad to be able to share this whole experience with all of you. So, talk soon. Bye.